Let's, let's get into the next topic, which is probably like my favorite topic of what's going on right now. So, uh, y'all y'all hit to punch made Dev, bro. That shit was fake, man. Feel me? Yeah, bro. Like these niggas, like, bro. Listen, bro. It's ain't it raw, bro? Like, right? Like, like that shit was staged, man. All right, so let's get let's before we before, let's give some background story to the people who don't know what punch made Dev is. So punch made Dev is a viral rapper coming out of I think North Carolina, and he's like the latest scam rapper that's coming up and coming right now. He, him and uh, Tommy G, if y'all ain't seen it, y'all know what Tommy G is. They do, he do vlogs and shit. Yeah. Him and Tommy G just did like a vlog. It got like 3.3 million views in like seven days. And it's just showing him where Punch Made Dave is basically going around teaching people how to scam or how to avoid getting scammed. But he's showing all the ways that he be working his jugs and stuff. So he did the documentary. He did the uh, vlog with uh, Tommy G. And then later on, I think maybe two, three days later, he get on stream with Aiden Ross. And he used Aiden Ross' card to actually buy a TV, and then he ended up getting arrested. Well, not arrested, but detained by the police that same night at Walmart. But here's the video of it, of him uh, using Aiden Ross' card. We're going to climb the protection. Hold on. What? Hey. Is that a Ridge wallet? What the fuck, dude? Yeah. Yeah. Ready? Oh. Man, man, bro. If you look at this shit, bro, I, I got some like some like. No way it works, dude. So crypto coins, man. No like, fucking way that works. To, to, like sell you niggas, man. Oh, nice. You leaked my. You just. You just leaked that. You just leaked that card that's connected to my fucking. Ba bro. Are you kidding me? Pick it up! Hey, and like he. And what like are you he, doing? He has a way a car that's linked to a bank with multi millions. All right. You know it's linked with multi millions. And, and, and he just said uh, it's linked to my account. There's another post that I just actually posted not that long ago. Yeah, it's him actually. Uh, all right, so here's another thing. So he had a song it's called it. Wire Fraud, but the police actually took it down because. Uh, or YouTube took it down. It was too fire? He's just giving out too much game. YouTube said it's against the terms and conditions. Yeah, you can't name your video why a fraud tutorial and expect to say up. Yeah. All right, so he uh he showed the messages where he said my, he, he messaged YouTube and said, my YouTube video was wrongfully removed. Uh, The wire fraud tutorial was solely a reenactment <laughs> to, I can't see from here, it's kind of uh, small, on how to protect themselves from fraud. Uh, Please reinstate my video so yeah have y'all seen any of the punch made dev thing is this real scamming yeah, bro like look. what's going on here like i seen in the video he had at least over a hundred thousand in cash he had multiple chains they were real yeah, exactly. it looked like he really getting to the money it wasn't no fake shit going on so what From is going what on i know about scamming punch made dev is official he's real right bro look sir. um yeah listen so do i personally think that punch made dev is out here Committing real, real wire fraud and scamming and rapping about it and Sounds nothing. Legit. I think he is right. Man, stop it, bro. Bro, he, bro, bro. Listen, and he knows a lot about it. Maybe because he used to do it, or, or like he has, you know, or like he has friends and homies who has done it. But if you niggas think that this nigga is committing real fraud did currently just, and rapping about it, y'all is crazy. Did he two, just do it on on that video, bro? No, bro, fam, fam. If y'all think that this man got Aiden Ross' car with multi millions on it, and he went and like he used it at Walmart to buy a fucking TV, it's a light flex on stream. Like, come on. Right, let me ask you this: It's obviously G? staged. It's fake. Man, come on, bro. Like, did you see the? Oh, it's staged, bro. What about, like, the, this, what about the Tommy on, G documentary? Oh, the, yes. Did you see that? All that stage too. He told him his address. Some some shit, right? What? In the Tommy G? Yeah, in the Tommy G shit. He told him like his address or his social or some shit. Yeah, he had Tommy G, he had Tommy G social and all that. Like, yeah, he pulled it up. So I'm just saying. So yeah, like, all right, bro. Maybe this particular in the, I mean uh, instance with the Aiden Ross could have been staged, couldn't have been. But there's a video of him actually getting detained by the police. If you want to pull it up, Josh. Yeah. So I don't know how staged it could be because he got detained. That's the police watching live and thought it was real, like you niggas. 
All right, so cool. <laughs> yeah, so, so listen. All right, so all right, so even all right. If the Aiden Ross thing is is staged, what about the the Tommy G documentary and all the other thing? Like how how is he obtaining yeah. all this hundred thousand dollars cash that he had with all these with all the diamonds that he had? Like, did you see all yeah, that? He has at all time, bro, high, folks. That's, so that's just fake. The jewelry well. fake listen and all up. that. Hey. Let's ask the real listen scammer. Up, right? Hold on, let me see what Bam Man Kevo got going. I want to see what Kevo think about this. <laughs> Let's ask the real scammer. I like that. <laughs> We're going to get Bam Man Kevo online? Let's see if Bam Man Kevo can answer the phone. Ask me if it's possible. Yo, Kevo. What's that? Is? All right, so yeah, this is Bam Man Kevo live on No Jumper News. All right, so we talking about the Punch May Dev shit. You see, are you 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 caught up with what's going on with Punch May Dev? Yeah, I've seen, I seen a, uh, like two videos, one with Aiden and one with... Um, him doing a um, YouTube video with some white dude. Yeah, all right. So he did a uh, he did a <laughs> he did a documentary with Tommy G, and that, it got like yeah. three point three million views in like seven days. Where he's going down, breaking down exactly how he does all his scams, and like Flacco yeah. is saying this cap. A lot of people in the comments saying this cap, it's but cool, Tommy bro. G. Said the money was real. Said the chains was real. So he so has I money. had to <laughs> I had to get. <laughs> I had to get the best yeah. person to talk about this on the phone. So you break it down to the people. Is it real? What's going on? So um, I feel like he he definitely is making money, but it's not from committing fraud. Um, of course not. I believe that he has a lot of people. So this is how you make money, doing what he do. So let's say if I'm putting out, you know, I do scams, I do this and I do that. He might have people paying him a lot of money to teach him, to teach them how to do things. But I don't believe he's out here you know, committing fraud, doing, like, like, just think about it like this, bro. If you did a video doing a crime, you're instantly going to jail. Like, you know what I mean? Like, ain't no <laughs> waiting. They're not going to wait around. And see, like, ain't, on, they're not going to cap with you. You're going straight to jail. Like, I just left jail at 19. So I'm knowing they're not playing. You feel me? Like, so I believe that it's a lot of it's kind of fake. You know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like the Aiden Roth believe. thing was fake. Um, I feel like, because I'm not just going to go get a TV. Um, <laughs> I will get, I will wait and really drain his ass all the way out. I wouldn't just go Cross. grab a, like, a, I'm not going to jail for a TV, put it like that, because you're going to get the same amount of times. Uh, identity theft, forgery, and fraud is a minimum mandatory of three years. I'm not going to, to jail for three years for a TV. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. But you seen the video where he ended up getting detained by the police after with the Aiden Ross situation? Now, that, 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 that is possible, but yeah, you can just tell him, hey, I'm doing this for entertainment purposes. I'm a rapper. This is all fake. Da, 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 da. Mm. I still feel like it's all cap. I, also, he probably only got detained because of the reader writer, but everything else is literally legit. You know what I mean? Because he's still an actor slash entertainer as well, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, nah. if you can tell, you can, like, if the police try to arrest you, for, he probably looked at suspicious because he had a. He probably got detained because of the mask he had on, and he looked at suspicious. But I don't believe it was for doing any crimes or anything like that. All right. So all right. And, with, with the Tommy G video, all right. So the Aiden Ross thing, it could have been staged. I agree with you. But in the Aiden, I mean, in the Tommy G vlog, he's rich. He has like over a hundred thousand. He has multiple chains. So like, you think he did acquire that maybe from past scams, and he just like no, yeah, or or giving game. Like, well, this is the thing about this. Just by us talking about this right now, it's probably going to make him an extra M, just being honest. Now, people who don't know, they watch the video, they say, oh, shit. All those scams that he talked about, I used to do them, and they're old as hell. Niggas do not use, like, do none of that shit no more. Like, that shit is super old. Now, wire, wires and shit like that, yeah, you can still do that. But it takes a lot of work. It takes a lot of connections, insides, and stuff like that. So I feel like, People might be paying him for knowledge, and mm. they might be. That's how he got the money he got. Not from fraud, not from skin. Trust me, bro. You know what I mean? If he'd been doing it for long enough, he they would have been nailed him. The lowest he'll be facing is 10 years. Yeah. Trust me. Fraud, 10 years. If he, anybody going to know, you going to know. That's all we had to ask. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. Yes, bro. Trust me, bro. Like, it's it's not even, it wouldn't even be worth it. If you're doing all that and getting all this money, you're not even going to let it be out. You're not going to try to train nobody teach nobody or nothing, nothing like that. You know what I mean? No, nah, I feel like that. I, I would have been the first to do that if I knew that I could do that. I'm <laughs> too scared to do what he did. You know what I mean? That's... I don't even want to play with them people or even ring any feathers or, you know what I mean? Like, raise any eyebrows type <laughs> thing, you know, with the FBI type thing. And I think I that's that. why the video is going so viral with Tommy G because it's like, is this dude really on here committing all these crimes and just telling everybody how he did it? 
but the, this is the thing. I know for a hundred percent fact, if you know what I mean, that the police, like the like the uh, uh, like uh, some type of big agency is looking into that, like the FBI. It's too viral, so it's kind of like I don't think I wouldn't have did. Like I I know all that step by step. I can break it down to somebody like step by step how to literally do everything. But there's no way that I would get on a video and break it down like the way he's doing it. That's kind of scary. You yeah, know? that was crazy, right? Yeah, true. Yeah, true. Yeah, no, nah, that was kind of crazy. But nah, if we knew if anybody who was gonna give good insight on this topic, we knew we had to tap in with Ben and Kevin for this one for sure, for sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. All right, well, yeah. Like so, so you calling? So you calling the cap? Yeah, I, I think it's uh, all entertainment purposes, which is smart. I, I ain't knocking his hustle. He doing what he doing. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Um. He get his bag, shit. Keep running it up. I don't think what he's doing, you know, I'm pretty sure he's not. I know he's smart enough not to just be out here committing crimes right now. You know what I mean? I know he ain't. You know, it's just a good, it's just a new wave and it looks good. Like, everything that we doing is like, like, whether it's on a movie, whether it's on a video, it can all be fake. You know what I mean? No, so, I feel that. Hey, Flacco got a question for you. Can you hear him? Hold on. Yeah. yeah. Yo, Kevo, yeah, yo, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Like... But your last song with Rich the Kid, right? Bruh. Yeah. How'd you get better at rapping, right? Cause, hey, right? Cause oh, look, right? Cause look. That's mad dick. Bro, I'll be real though. Listen, listen to Kevin. Wait though. Kevin from 2020. Like, he's like, and the nigga that I saw rapping, like, last month was a whole different nigga, bro. Like, how? So look, so look, this is the thing. Like, Ghost Riders like, or what? Big folks, look, uh -huh. let me tell you, big folks been asking me, like, to drop music, right? Mm -hmm. But I've been making so much money off education that I don't be one, like, too much caring to drop music. But, bro, I got over 100 raw-ass songs that he be like, bro, shoot the video, bro. Drop some more music and do this and do that. But I'm telling him, like, bro, the music wave is dying, bro. Yeah. Like, right now, it's a media run that's going to be, that's going to be crazy. Podcasts and it's switching over. All the rappers are going broke. All the niggas that they used to say that was lame are going to be the rich niggas. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. So I'm I'm trying to show him, like, bro, rapping's not really it. But as far as rapping, bro, I got a lot of crazy shit. That you got to think, I've been locked up for three and a half years. I wrote hella music that I just had saved in my notebook and just had shit that I haven't put out. You feel me? Mm. Yeah, man. Yeah, All right, yeah, I, got, I got a question, though, because this is going to be the million dollar question that everybody been thinking about. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. is Flacco on your payroll? Bro, we done ask that same Flacco question like probably like two hundred times already. Let him talk because this is a question that the fans. Bro, been we asked it to him a hundred times already. I've like, never personally me? asked Flacco this, but this is the this Flacco has been the thing that the fans answer. have definitely. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, like come let on. him let him speak. I yeah, just want to hear it out of Ben Man Kevin's mouth himself. So, because Flacco uh, holds you down uh, a lot. Uh, we asked the same question no, to him. Flacco definitely my homie shit, but Flacco and big folks, you know what I mean? They um they in business together and shit, you know. So um you know. That's that's really really it. Not not signed to me or anything like that. No, nah, yeah. If you were signed to me, you would know. Mm -hmm. Like if, if you were signed to me, like you would definitely know. Like you know, I wouldn't be hiding it or anything like oh, that. Are you gonna get that nigga iced up, Cuban up type yeah, shit? That's what you're saying. He already yeah. is. Like, we we not, we even though Flacco gonna get there regardless. You know what I mean? Like like I said, big folks got him right now, so. We all we all gonna work on getting niggas to the next level. That's the whole goal, you know. But nah, facts. I feel that. Nah, yeah. Flacco to go. I just had to ask that. That's been a lingering question that. The, the fans just gonna want to know that shit. It's not like room. Yeah, yeah. That's definitely he came here lingering. Wait. Niggas in the room is looking around at everyone in the room. Definitely. Adam asked him it twice already. I asked him it twice. Yeah, yeah, bro. Right, right, I don't like. Know. We, well, we heard it. We heard it from the horse's mouth. We have like five clips about this. I do. And all no jumper clips. Do we? Yes, yes. Of this exact same question. I don't know. I'll be doing the clips. I don't remember that. But uh, yes, man, man, Kevin. I appreciate you for calling in over or me calling you and you yeah, answering. You know what I'm saying? But, so you call the cap on the punch made dev is all semantics, it's all entertainment. Yeah, it's all entertainment, yeah. All right, appreciate you, bro. Bro, all listen, right, bro. man. When I tell y'all that I know what I'm talking about, y'all don't believe me. But what, what, what tell y'all, bro? Cap shit, man. Come on, bro. I'm calling cap on the on the Adam Ross shit, but bro, on the Tommy G shit, bro. It's shit impossible, real. bro. Come on. Though he got money, yes, like, right? Like we know this, bro. You feel me, right? And he knows how to do do it from right, but but bro. It, if y'all think that he's out here committing wire fraud for M's and he's being able to rap about it, stop it, bro. Do you know the difference between the 201 piece and the 101? No. What? The chip on the card. No, I don't oh, know nothing. I don't exactly. Even know. 
Right. If he if he using a car that had, that needs a chip, which mm. all cars need chips now mm. since 2016, he would have to jam that shit three times before he swipes. He swiped on the first go and the shit went through. Car ain't had no chip. Shit was the 201. This is game that you use actually. This thing, bro, listen, right? bro I know it. real scammer stuff. Like, like wait, wait, wait I, through. I, I was a real scammer. No, 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 no. wait through, right? Uh-huh. Right? Wait through, right? Like, I'm not talking about like the hundred thousand. No, bro. Like, like I know, like, like for example, a, a real scammer who's been with Hush Puppy. Who's like, I'm talking about M's, tens of M's, right? Like, right, like, right, like them niggas. Will never hop on no interviews. Would never hop on uh, because some do, niggas wouldn't man. do something. That don't mean nobody would do it. Man, come on, Facts. right, bro? Let's, bro. Look, like this be like a real scammer. If I, if I, yeah, um, <laughs> you give it up too much. I'm gonna tell y'all and, uh, and uh, off camera, right? But bro, like, like the real scammers that I know, bro. Didica said, bro, I would never do no interview like talking about <laughs> like for what? Like That's I'm up. Them. up up at tens of M's already. You feel me? That's them. Right? So for this motherfucker here, what, what? A hundred thousand? Like maybe a M? Which I doubt is an M, right? But, right? The, to be like rapping and talking about it, man, it's obviously cap, bro. Son, but he obviously knows something. That's what I'm saying. Of, of course, yeah. yeah. He he definitely running it up. From what I've seen, I'm not going to lie. He fooled me for a little bit. Kevo saying it's fake, but he, he got that money somehow. You know what I'm saying? If it's fake... He he's, wouldn't have been in the in the Walmart he, with the MSR. The, the MSR is real. You get caught with that, you're doing some time. Off the rip.